Hi, everybody. Welcome back to EA Sports. It has been anything but a friendly homestand here, but they'll try to close out the final game on home ice tonight with a W. Opening face-off just moments away. The Blue Jackets will look to go on the offensive as they win the opening draw. Sends it into the offensive zone. Takes the feed. Eichel swooping in on the attack. Trying to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Well, he's showing off his skill set, trying to make a silky move around the defender, but he gets denied. Columbus plays the puck along the boards. Great save, played it perfect. Hills opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. Still plenty of time left in this frame. We've still got zeros on the board. The Blue Jackets take possession here inside the offensive zone. The Golden Knights have it from their own end. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Marcheseau. The Golden Knights have it in the offensive zone. Quick pass to Eichel. Quick shot. Scores! Mark Stone coming up big again. Well, this is just a great job to get the hands away from the body and deflect that puck into the net. Changes direction, goaltender doesn't have a chance. Vegas has a quick one nothing lead here in this one, and the home fans are all into it. And they should love it, James, because it's an entertaining brand of hockey. When you're playing fast with a ton of pace, the fans love it. And when you put the puck in the net, it's even better. They go on the attack from the left side. Columbus takes possession of the puck. The Blue Jackets will play it from the defensive zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Oh, what a hit on the play! And he's on his own bench there, Cheryl. Well, the only good thing is he's not on the opponent's bench, right? He'd be getting a face wash if he was over there, but instead he's on his teammate's bench, and you know what? They're going to pick him up. Sends it ahead to Provorov. Vegas has it near the wall. Great defensive effort with the stick. And he slides it quickly to Stevenson. All sorts of pressure here in the offensive end. They've really turned it up a notch now. And they pick up the puck here in their own end. Change is coming up front as they send the puck in. Quick feed to Theodore. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Here's a feed in front. And that goes off the body and a ride. Puck not loose in neutral zone. Straight up the middle, here they come. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. Moves into the slot. Decides to think about it. Gets the puck in deep. Vegas takes hold of the puck. Picked up along the wall by Theodore. Moves it to Wah. Stone's had an impressive game tonight. He scored earlier, and you know that he really manages the momentum in the game well, and he certainly creates it for his team. And the puck's knocked loose. Grabbed along the boards by Provorov. Tarasov's been showing more confidence in this game with that nice save. I mean, it was a tough one the other night when he got flown out. Huge save right there to give him some confidence. Denied that one. I really like this save, James, because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. Here's a short pass to Haig. Great reach with the poke check by Texier. Across the line from center. With possession along the wall. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Great heads up play with the stick by Wierenski. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Vegas looks to get things going now with the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Eichel. Poked away by Bofist. Moves along the boards with some purpose. Moves it quickly over to Line. Centering feed! And he denies that great opportunity there. Eichel's been feeling it, James. You know who else is feeling it? His teammates. They have been the beneficiaries of a great leader on the ice who's just been distributing the puck and generating a ton of offense. 
Columbus wins possession right off the draw. Oh, and it goes wide! You gotta get a shot on that, James. You get in tight, you have an opportunity in that scoring area, and you don't even get a shot on that. Not good enough. Columbus plays it up the ice. On the attack along the boards. Tries to the sweet spot. Scores! And the scratching and clawing has paid off as we are back to even. Well, we're back to evens, James. I really like their game. I mean, when you're pushing and you're trying to find a way to get ahead and on top, you have to trust the process. That's exactly what they've done, and they've been rewarded for it. Still lots of time left here in this frame. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. The Golden Knights win it. Puck is grabbed here at center ice by Stevenson. Can't hang on after that hit. The Blue Jackets played along the wing. Handles a sweet feed. Can't get it to go. Quick feed to McNabb. And that's picked off by Marchenko. Columbus plays it along the wing. Big time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. Does a great job with some great pushes to get to the top of his crease and make the save from a high danger area. Feeds it over to Carlson. Makes a move in front. Oh, he had a beat, but it goes off the inside post. The Golden Knights bring another one off the post. It's unbelievable how many times they've hit it tonight. I mean, they'd be up by a bunch. Wouldn't be a tie game if that were the case. Stevenson's called for tripping. He's off to the box. struggle here, but we've also seen them working hard on their positioning in practice. It's the first power play of the game, and if they can capitalize here, it might just give them the momentum that they need. Let's see what happens. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. Quick pass to Johnson. And that's poked away by Haig. The Golden Knights will kill off a few extra seconds now. Was got it along the wing. Stopped by the goaltender. When the puck's in the low slot, the goaltender gets right out next to the shooter and makes the save. Just moments away from the resumption of this power play, they're ready to drop the puck here for this faceoff. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Columbus is across the line and in the offensive zone. Oh my goodness, it stayed out. What a save. It was all the will to get to that puck, I was on display. Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. Cotter's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. Quick feed to Petrangelo. Gets it out of his own end. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Line A's taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. Let's see the call here. The Golden Knights have been handed a two minute penalty for tripping. Columbus with a five-on-three advantage here on their special teams. Playing with a two-player advantage on the five-on-three is such an opportunity. But you have to have a sense of urgency that goes along with it. You don't want to be static. You do want to force the coverage to have to move a little bit. And they send it down the ice. Directed over to Provorov. And now he angles it across to Marchenko. Vegas will try to kill a few seconds off this penalty. And the puck's kicked free. And a successful clearing attempt. The Blue Jackets move the puck in the defensive zone. Tries to the crease with the stop. Moves it to Roslovic. Moves it to the middle. Picked off in front. Nice job to escape the zone. 
Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Stevenson's penalty has expired, but they remain shorthanded, and he joins the kill. Feeds it to Roslovic. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. Here's a shot. He scores! And there it is, number 20 on the year. Well, that's a milestone, James. It isn't easy to beat the goaltenders in this league, and he's done it 20 times. This is a great power play goal, James. They have the execution in terms of their passing along the outside, and then they attack the net with a shot. You have to have net front presence and create a screen. That's exactly what they have, and they capitalize as a result. Columbus has a one-goal lead here in the back half of the first, and Cheryl, you're starting to see some control this game now. I think it's because they're wearing their opponent down. They're in the offensive zone. They can't get the puck, and they're finding a way to get it to the net. And guess what? After the shot, they're finding a way to retrieve it as well. When you hunt pucks, you own possession as well. Oh, how did he get a piece of that? Puck knocked loose after that hit. And it's a quick pass to Wawrenski. And he takes the feed. Denies him! Vegas has it in the defensive end. Here's a pass down low. That's some smart heads up defensive play by Texier. Intercepted. Slides it across to Theodore. Poked away at center by Johnson. The Blue Jackets looking against the half wall. And that goes off course off the body. And he makes a save there. Vegas plays it up ahead. Drives it to the crease. Oh, a solid heads up play to knock it down. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. Gains the zone through center. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. Trying to make the move when you have good. Oh, well, there's going to be a call on that one, James. Well, look at this, Cheryl. Here we go. The parade is officially underway. It certainly is. And everyone in the building, you can hear the crowd just jeering with their frustration, including everyone on the bench, completely deflated right now. A non-stop procession with a penalty box for the home team. Wierenski's a solid defender, but he can still throw up points for his club. Eichel's unstoppable force zone ability is his strength and balance when skating with the puck. He rarely gives it up when getting jostled by defenders. I'll be keeping tabs on these players all night long, and let's see if one of them can lead their team to victory. Guys, back to you. Columbus gains a hold of the puck against the boards. The Blue Jackets have it now. He's got a step. Jenner's Great play by the tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. Oh, that's tremendous poise in the defensive end to break off the pass. Handles the pass. Here's a short pass to Jenner. The Golden Knights have possession shorthanded. Columbus takes possession along the wall. Trying to gain a step. Flips it across. Slides it across. Denies him on the breakaway. Jenner's been brought Columbus has it against the half wall. Scores! And I guess they won't need that power play after all. Well, it's a delayed call, and it almost looks as that the defensive structure collapses. And man, do they take advantage. I love the patience of this power play. It's all about puck movement. And when you're going to let a shot go, you want to make sure that there's traffic net front. And that's exactly what happens. The goaltender screen, and they find the back of the net. Well, I really like them working off the 1 3 1 sequence that they were successful on earlier, James. It really opens up the ice. So you're using and stretching the entire zone. And listen, there's a lot of ice for the defense to cover. So you can look to the flanks, you can look to the bumper, but a lot of options off of it. Sends it in on the attack. Puck moved over to Boquist. Nice zone entry from the middle. Knocked away in the offensive zone. The Blue Jackets have it behind the net. Playing big in the moment there. Potter's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. And let's see what the call is. The Blue Jackets are going to be shorthanded, tripping the call.
as we get set for the face-off, a chance to see both teams in a little four-on-four -four action here. Well, four-on-four -four is similar to three-on-three. -three. There's more ice available, and you can't just dump it in. You want to possess the puck and try and create numbers around the ice. That's two-on-ones all over. Along the right side into the offensive zone. And he comes up big with the stick save, getting all of it with the paddle. Lets it fly, makes the save. They go on the attack through center. To the front, and that's deflected off someone in front. Moves it to the middle, and another pass. Couldn't complete the pass. Moves it up through the middle from the right. The Blue Jackets take it along the wall. Picked up along the boards by Jenner. Moves it quickly over to Haig. Columbus gains control of the puck. And a brief power play will ensue now as the penalty expires. Quick pass to Stone. And that doesn't reach the net. And he rings the post. The Golden Knights are trying to shrink their deficit in this game. They're playing aggressive in the offensive zone. And they just wire one off the post as they try and claw their way back in. Fires it into the offensive zone. Power play is over. Both teams back to even strength. Coach won't be happy with that, James. Didn't make the PK unit move at all. You have to create some motion and make adjustments based on what they're doing. And this power play unit didn't do any of it. Gets the puck in deep. Vegas has possession of it now. And he slides it quickly to Carlson. Now he takes it over the line. Beans has got it in the defensive zone. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Makes a save. Let's it go. Stuffs him again. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Here in the late goings of the period, Columbus is enjoying a 3-1 lead to this point. The Blue Jackets take possession off the faceoff. What a stop with the paddle by Hill. Now the shooter's going to run out of real estate because he does a great job of getting out of top of the crease and taking away all the room. When you make yourself as big as possible, there's less holes in the net. Made the save on the play. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Columbus slides the puck behind the net. Scores just before the period closes. Cheryl, absolutely huge. The last few minutes of a period are essential, and they go to the dressing room with needed momentum. That's a hard shot. The goaltender looks like he's just getting to position, gets a piece of it, but it still goes in. are up big here late in the first period. Columbus wins that face off at center. That's taken away. Great defensive effort there. From point blank. Oh, what a stick save. There's the horn ending the first period. Both teams will have a chance to regroup. You do you, and we'll be back with period number two in a moment. If you want to show us your accuracy, Register now for our shoot to win contest for one lucky fan. Both teams back on the ice are lined up, and period number two is about ready to go. Here we go. Lots of time left in this one, but certainly a lopsided affair to this point. Broken up by Wierenski. Quick feed to Theodore. That goes off the post and stays out. Scores! And I think he put this. and with fire if you want to be successful. So dictating the pace is going to be the next up. Poked away at center by Texier. And now he moves it quickly to line A. The Blue Jackets will play it in their own end. The Golden Knights gain control of the puck against the wall. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Quick pass over to Johnson. 
Now a quick pass to Line. Poked away in the offensive zone by Eichel. Dishes it to Bopis. Moves it to Stone. The Golden Knights played along the boards. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Here's a short pass to Marchenko. Barbashev's got it now deep inside his own end. They've got numbers here. Phenomenal save with the glove to knock it away. Lots of time left in this period. The Golden Knights are still trailing by two. Back underway and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Provorov's taking it from his own end. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. Play is called for offside. Columbus continues to lead here early in the second, getting lots of shots on goal to this point. And they win that neutral zone draw. Moves it quickly over to Barbashev. And a solid save on the play there. And does it again. That's a fantastic sequence of saves there. James, he was so dialed in, he tracked it perfectly. Columbus looks to break out in their own end. Quick pass to Watt. Here's a shot. Denied by the goaltender. Tremendous intensity here in the offensive end, and the whole crowd is loving this. Poor shot. Great save in front by the goaltender. The D picks it up, but they are still under pressure. I'm going to guess that he's going to look to drive the net and shoot the puck, given that he's one goal away from his next milestone. And now he moves it to Petrangelo. Vegas heavy hit into the wall. And look at this. We're going to get a stoppage here as the whistle's blow. A pane of glass is broken. Well, safety is the first priority, and it was a thunderous hit. And as a result, there's a crack in the pane. And they'll have to replace that, James. The maintenance crew will come out here and make sure that it's taken care of. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway. The Blue Jackets win the draw on their own end. Through center along the wing. And now it's over to Jenner. Cuts into the paint. Big time stop by Hill. Dished on over to Watt. And that's knocked away in the defensive end by Bean. Moves around along the half wall. And he loses control here. The Golden Knights move it in. Takes it off, but he's still got the puck. Angles it over to Marchenko. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Hill's gonna give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. More than half the period left to play. Columbus has been the more impressive squad tonight as they have a 4-2 lead. The Blue Jackets win the draw. The Golden Knights take possession in the defensive end. Quick feed to Eichel. Sends a pass over. Delayed penalty coming up here. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Shot. Oh, a clutch save. There's the whistle, and here's the call. And yet another penalty is called, so out comes the PK unit. And you know what? They are taxed. They are worn down. If this continues, it's all going to backfire. Teams. Well, they've worked on this setup in practice on the power play. It's already worked for them this evening, James. You can certainly see the confidence that they have in this particular setup. The man is if ineffective. Great save! The Blue Jackets scoop it up along the boards. His reflexes on display tonight. That's a great save, but the goaltender had to get out to the top of his crease, take away all the ice, and make himself as big as possible. Jenner stick handling in his own zone. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. And the puck leaves the zone. Moves it to Marchenko. Amadio's got it in the defensive end. Carter's going to play it against the half wall. Oh, what a stop with the blocker by Tarasov. 
Columbus has the puck. Tosses it to Provorov. Poked away by Petrangelo. Puck picked up by Jenner. Oh, spectacular save right there! Wow! Unbelievable. I mean, it was all but in, and he steals it because of that last-ditch attempt to find the puck. Just incredible save, James. Covers it up, and we'll get a stoppage in play. Another face-off looming here on this power play. The Golden Knights will start off on the attack after winning the draw. And that's blocked in traffic. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Puts it on net, comes up with the stop. Takes the pass. Right up the gut into the offensive end. Quick shot. Oh, we got a piece of it to keep it out. Tarasov's had a solid night between the pipes, James. I mean, he's done everything he could to stop the puck, as indicated by his save percentage, but his team has also been really strong. Got the confidence of their netminder, and they've created a ton of opportunities. The Blue Jackets fail to capitalize on the man advantage. Both sides back to even strength. PK is a skill set, James. You have to have the ability to read and anticipate, and they did an effective job, and they got some huge opportunities. Great pressure on the offensive end by Marcheseau. He carries the puck up along the wing. Line A, stunned against the boards. And that's intercepted by Stone. Vegas has been so good shutting down the middle of the ice. They're anticipating the passes and they're closing quickly. And because of that, they're turning pucks over and intercepting them as well. Works it across to Petrangelo. Denied by the defender. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. The Golden Knights look to start the transition game. Slides the puck across to Theodore. The Golden Knights carry it along the wall. Tries to feed it over. It's a two on one. And they're on the attack. Feeds it over. Blocked with a capital B ending that rush. Stone's last play was a tough one, James. He loses his balance, which makes it difficult for him to corral the puck and get it off with precision. But he makes the play. Moves the puck down low. Backhander denies him in close. And the puck's booted away. And he takes the pass. Here they come. Down the left side on the attack. Here's a short pass to Olivier. Back to the point it goes. Goalie with a stop. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Columbus has looked good offensively tonight, putting a lot of pucks on net, and as a result, they lead here in the second. Offense his own face off, and he wins the draw. Turned aside with a glove by Hill. Past the midway mark in this period. It's a two-goal lead here tonight. 4-2 is where we're sitting. Carlson's won it in their own end. Feeds the puck to Martinez. Moves into the offensive zone. Columbus gains control of the puck. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Great poke check on the reach. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. And it's kicked away. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Smart heads up play to neutralize the threat. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. The Blue Jackets will play it from the corner. And officials right on top of that one call it for a slashing penalty, it looks like. Well, the refs are calling a really tight game, and man, this has been a parade to the penalty box, and the entire bench looks agitated, and as a result, they keep taking more. Taken along the wall by Marchenko. 
through the neutral zone up along the wing. Here he is in the backhand. Stars! And they strike once again with the extra attacker. Wow, this has been a potent power play. And two things you need. You need creativity, but you also need structure. And the players know exactly where they need to be to set up, to work their magic around the perimeter, and then open up the lanes to attack the net. has continued to widen the gap here in period number two. Yeah, continuing to widen the lead. And when you play with this type of lead, you can look a little bit different, in particular on the offensive zone. You can try different things, but one thing has to stay consistent, the way you attack the net. Along the half wall with the puck. Makes the save, cool and calm under pressure. Slides the puck over. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. In close. Great save from in tight. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Shot! It's there it is! He scores! All over the rebound, and he tucks it in! Well, good things happen when you put the puck to the net, and this rebound comes right back out to him. But he's tracking, he's sniffing, he's hounding, and he finds the back of the net on the second shot. has continued to punish in the offensive zone. Wow, what a night they're having. Yeah, they certainly established presence in this one, haven't they? Right from puck drop. I mean, they've been first to the puck. They've retrieved it. They pounded it all over the ice. And it's been like a string on their stick. Taken by Marcheseau. Moves the puck along the half wall. Off the post. Vegas working so hard to generate some offense, James. And unfortunately, it keeps going off the post. They're going to have to redirect or change their angle of their shot. They're getting a little too fine here. Theodore's lugging the puck. Gain momentum up along the side. And that's intercepted by Lane. Slides the puck to Texier. Takes the feed. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Man, he was right on that puck. He knew exactly where it was. It was tight to the crease. He got out and challenged right away to make the save. The Blue Jackets with a total team effort to this point as they lead comfortably here in the second. Takes the puck. He'll keep it alive and moves it ahead. Moves it quickly over to Eichel. Good use of the body to knock him off the puck. The Golden Knights gain possession and tries to make a diagonal pass to Eichel. Moves it to the middle. Can't connect the play. And they'll dump it in. The Golden Knights gain control of the puck. Slides the pass over to Cotter. Columbus takes hold of the puck. Moves it on over to Olivier. And that's stolen in the offensive zone. And he turned that one aside. Columbus with possession in their own zone. Poked away in the neutral zone by Polisar. Play rolls on. Comes up with a big time glove save. Quick pass to Polisar. And he takes the dish. Takes it to the front. Quick feed to Haig. Fires one. Walker saving a good one at that. Under all sorts of pressure, trying to protect the puck. Columbus on the attack. Battling for it along the boards. And nearing the final minute of the second.
made the goaltending change, James. You want to get your starter out of the net. You want to reset your group. Try and see if you can garner some momentum, and it might come off of a save by your goaltender who's come in relief. But unfortunately, that doesn't happen. The team just isn't playing well, and another one winds up in the back of the net. The Blue Jackets have to be feeling good about themselves here in the late stage of the second period as they continue to lead big. Good read by the winger as the two centers tie up. Columbus looks to move the puck from their own end. That's a good footwork to kick it away. And he slides it quickly to Line. Columbus brings the puck in from center. Here's a shot. Big save just as time runs out. There's the horn bringing period number two to an end. 40 minutes down, 20 to go. Third period action is coming up. Sabalski ready to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third. Let's see if anything changes. Two-thirds of the way to the finish line, and this one for regulation time. Cheryl, how do you view it? Score! build off that now, Cheryl. Yeah, momentum is only good, James, when you can build on it. If it just stays there static and nothing happens, guess what? It goes the other way. So this next shift is critically important. The time is not on their side, so they have to find a way to counter quickly and provide a much-packed punch. Scooped up along the wall by Marcheseau. Strong defensive effort. Stone's got it in the offensive zone. Beautiful stop to get a piece of it with the glove. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. The Golden Knights have it from their own end. Eichel's got it on the offensive end. And just got a piece of it to keep it out. Columbus continues to lead early in this third period. Big story tonight for them. Their offense came to play. Carlson's won the face-off, and now let's see what they can do. Slip feed. Gets in front of it for the block. Over the line they come. Jenner's had such an impressive night offensively. You know that's his wheelhouse, as he loves to have the puck on his stick. He creates, he's confident with it, and he's got a multi-point game. Sends it down low. Here's a short pass to Theodore. Big hit, and that frees up possession. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. From his own end, he moves it up ahead. Slides it over with pace to Theodore. Feeds the puck across to White Cloud. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. And it's a quick pass to Marchenko. Inside the attacking zone, down the left wing. Feeds the puck to Marchenko. Sends the pass over. He scores! This is just a great goal, James. It just reiterates that in today's game, the hands are separate from the body. He's stumbling and still has his eyes on the puck. Not in the greatest position, but manages to get a shot off that beats the tender. Columbus has continued to run up the score here, even in the third. James, their opponent's been chasing the game all night long. 
is starting to show a little respectability here amongst themselves as they get one back. Yeah, it's about mojo. It's how you end the game with good habits because you want to make sure that you don't carry the beginning of the game into your next one. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. From the right side and up the middle. The Golden Knights have the puck in the corner. Here's a shot. And that one stopped. Quick pass to Amadio. And now it's taken by Roth. Oh, what a save in front. Columbus moves ahead with the puck. Dumps it in. Vegas gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Quick feed to Amadio. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Oh, what a save on the play. Wow. Oh, that's Grand Larceny, James. I mean, he just stole one away from his opponent. What a save. The Blue Jackets are in the home stretch of this one here in the third period and lead by a wide margin. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers are tied up. Moves it to Stone. Slides it back to the blue line. Blocked in traffic. Here's a short pass to McNabb. Toss up the puck after that hit. Vegas has it near the wall. Of it to keep it out of the net. Handles the puck. Takes a couple of knocks and loses control. And he slides it quickly to Martinez. Receives the pass. And that caroms off a body in the lane. Moves it quickly over to Stone. Puck grabbed by Severson. Gaining steam inside the neutral zone. Quick pass to Line A. Knocked away with the stick by Eichel. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck along the boards. Slits it in front! Scores! What a finish on the play! Listen, James, when he works himself into position to set up for that one-timer, if you're his teammate, you just find him and you deliver it to him. The Golden Knights are showing a little pride here in the third. And really, that's all that it's about right now. This game is over, and you can see they just want this game and the clock to tick down. They want that final buzzer to go. Columbus takes possession at center. Dumps it into the ozone. Vegas has it in the defensive end. Through the neutral zone and along the boards. Here they come. Moves it to the middle. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Tarasov's got it, and I think there's a little strategy involved as he opts for the whistle. Well, yeah, I think he needs a rest, but it's also about game management. Listen, the only reason why they're winning this game is because he has been electric and dynamic between the pipes. And a solid job tying up his opponent. The Blue Jackets move the puck in the defensive zone. Here we go, pucks in deep. Slides it quickly to Carlson. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. And that's a great heads up in the defensive zone to force the turnover. The Golden Knights have it against the wall. Fires it on net. Oh, what a paddle save on the play. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Scores! Clanky Clank dares the hat trick, his first of the season. Well, the puck's finding him. He's on it. He's in it. He's all around it. And he's finishing it, James. That's a great night for him.
zone, they get the puck. Vegas takes it across the line. And that's a smart heads up play by Jenner. Good solid check and he loses control of it. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Petrangelo's home down, penalty on the way. Time for the officials to hand out the judgment. The Blue Jackets are gonna be short-handed as they are called for tripping. Well, things should open up for both sides here with a little four-on-four -four action. A few ways to play a four-on-four. -four. You can sit back or you can be very aggressive on the puck, but you have to make sure that you're aware as well. There's more ice out there for your opponent too. Knocked away by Petrangelo. Slides it across to Theodore. Getting a little physical out there, but still holds on to the puck. And now he moves it quickly to Eichel. And he takes a shot. And that's blocked from someone in front. The Blue Jackets scoop it up along the boards. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Columbus gets a hold of it. Well, the game certainly isn't predictable, is it, James? As it's going back and forth, goals from all areas as players shoot from all angles and attack the zone. Theodore's tripped up and the official's hand is in the air, signaling penalty. Everybody Let's see what the official way. makes for the final decision. The Blue Jackets are being called for tripping. Vegas will go to work on the power play with a four on three advantage. Four on three, what a huge opportunity here. The ability to move the puck, create open lanes, and look for that one timer. And the puck clears the zone. Vegas takes possession along the wall. And that's off a stick. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. Vegas has possession of it now. Into the offensive side. The Blue Jackets have possession shorthanded. Picks off the pass in the defensive zone. Puck moved back to center, forcing them to regroup. Moves it over to Barbashev. Moves the puck. Here they come on the attack. Jabs the puck away. Handles it along the blue line. And a quick save on that one. This is an impressive save right here, James. I mean, there's a ton of net front presence, and so a lot of traffic that he has to battle through to find the puck, and he does, and he makes a nice save. Now a quick pass to Carrier. Here's a chance! On a big-time save on a big-time shot! The Golden Knights will become road warriors when they open up a road trip for their next game, and sometimes things just get simplified. I know a lot of people talk about home ice advantage, but sometimes playing on the road does have its perks bringing a team together. Vegas has it in the offensive end. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Tarasov! Corrales ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Ronnie ties up his opponent. Here's a chance to get it out. And they clear the zone, and that'll shave some time off. A great sequence by the PK unit. Really aggressive, close quickly on the puck, and they get it down the ice. Oh, a chance to make a nice move, and the puck disagreed with him. That opportunity's rejected. Play whistle dead as the puck goes into the bench, and I think that woke up a few players. Still some precious time left on this power play as they get set to drop the puck. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Quick feed to Theodore. Vegas slides it along the line. Oh, that goes just one. I think he had more time than he thought here, James, with the pressure coming in on him. He just releases the puck quick and he misses wide. Vegas gets the puck near the boards. From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. And that's a great defensive heads up to force the turnover. Slides into Bokvist. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. Vegas has it in their own zone. The Golden Knights cross the line and gain the zone. Huge steal in his own end. As an athlete, you always want to try.
try and contribute and get things going for your team, and especially when you're trailing, you want to ignite a spark. Unfortunately, though, they, he tried it a little too much there, and it gets taken away. All alone! Oh, and I think he got confused with the score! And that's back-to-back -back goals! Well, nothing like switching the mention and putting your opponent on their heels and getting two in a row back-to-back. -back. Here they come. And this is a really smart shot through traffic, James. The recognition of the net front presence in screen, and the goalie drops to the butterfly position. Really tries to make himself as big as possible, hoping that the puck just hits him because he can't see it. Columbus hasn't allowed for any let up in the third period. They continue to apply that pressure. They're applying the pressure and they've dominated the game right from puck drop. I mean, their opponent has no answer or any pushback because of the way they're playing. Takes the pass to the left wing. Moves it to Marcus Oh, the goes off the bucket and he keeps it out. Well, fortunate for him that these masks are made so well nowadays because he just got his bell rung. And he takes the feed. Thompson's got the puck and he's gonna hang on. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Oh, tried to pick his corner and puts it off the outside of the post. The Blue Jackets putting on a clinic in the offensive zone, trying to pad their stats and increase their lead. The puck has been on their stick all night long. This one goes off the post. It's a tough one. You can see the frustration there. Every shooter wants to score. And that skips out of the offensive end. And he maintains possession of the puck here. The Blue Jackets gain possession. Takes a shot. Comes up with the stop. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. Great four check by Texier. Guas moving the puck through his own zone. Grabbed in the open ice by Carrier. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Nice feed inside the offensive zone from the boards. Turned aside with the glove by Tarasov. Here's a change. The Blue Jackets start with the puck in their own end. Puck scooped up by Provorov. Takes the feed. Columbus plays the puck along the boards. Denied by the goaltender. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. And that's a great read to force the turnover. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Looks to set up at the point now. Good eyes him on the play. And he takes the feed. And he puts that one aside with ease. Grabbed along the board by Barbashev. Quick pass across to Whitecloud. Here's a shot. That's blocked by Tarasov. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Corrales won the face-off. Great read by Stone. Oh, and a good save by Tarasov! The Golden Knights are running out of time as they trail late in this third period. Vegas wins the draw. That's blocked. Here's a short pass to Eichel. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Here comes the call. Well, it's been a complete blowout, James. Now you take a penalty and it stops the clock. It's a frustrating night. You just want to move on. Jackets have it from their own end. Trying to gain a step. All alone. Great save. Thompson's going to hang on to the puck for the whistle. Cotter 
outside, still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Comes in off the wing as both centers were tied up on the draw. And his goaltender's not gonna like that one as he scores, putting it into his own net. Well, you don't see that very often when you shoot it into your own net trying to clear the puck. That's ugly. Columbus continues to be on point here in this third period, finding more and more offense. Well, yeah, I mean, they've been generating offense. They've been strong in their own zone as well, James. They've just been great from start to finish. The coach is going to love this one. It's been a terrific performance, a 200-foot game that's led to this score. Marchenko is able to corral that pass. He's got the puck on his stick. You know he's dangerous. He's got two in the game, and he's looking for another. 